Hi guys, uh, this is Sector. Uh, today is the uh, 21st of uh, June 2007. It's uh, uh, 8 to uh, 9 a.m. Uh, Euro time. I'm looking into the uh, um, uh, GBP CHF. Uh, Alright, I've just triggered uh, uh, in my entry right there uh, at 2.46.99. Uh, um, uh, I triggered my long entry for a London Open type of try, Takai. Um, uh, if, uh, if we have a look at the hourly chart, um, it seems like, uh, um, well, like I say, it seems like we're setting up for a, for a London Open type of try right there. Um, we see uh, a nice uh, uh, up uh, trending week, okay, making uh, higher highs and uh, higher lows, okay, and uh, also we have a, um, a clear uptrend, and um, and uh, well, basically, uh, um, uh, we're seeing a break on now to the upside as as the euro session uh, begins to kick in. So it seems like. Um, um, uh, well, we might be setting up for uh, yeah, um, London uh, Open uh, uh, breakout type of trade. Um, so, uh, well, I, I, I believe that perhaps the uh, the uh, following, um, uh, well, the uh, the overall uh, mood for the rest of the day is going to be uh, to the upside. Okay, I'm going to try to uh, well exploit, like I say, that. Um, that uh, uh, up uh, mood for the rest of the day. Uh, if uh, if we uh, have a look at the 15-minute chart, uh, what we see is uh, well, first uh, in the one hour in the hourly chart, uh, we see that we were forming a kind of a, a double uh, top right there. Okay, and and seems like uh, as as as, uh, as the uh, Tokyo session was wearing on. We are pressuring on this level on the uh, uh, 24680 level right there. Okay, and as, as London uh, market opened, if, if we have a look at the um, at the 15 minute chart, uh, it seems like it's uh, yeah, we finally uh, broken that level uh, to the upside right there with a posterior retries. Okay, you see that red bar right there. Okay. And uh, well, I've that made me believe that uh, uh, well, the uh, my 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 typical um, London Open and breakout uh, setup, you know, a breakout to the upside, uh, retrace and continuation uh, is in place. Okay, and if, uh, like I said, I've just triggered my 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 entry as as we made uh, new new highs for uh, for today. Okay, um, I'm I'm not really expecting. I'm not really expecting that much of a move uh, out of this out of this setup. Uh, I'm only aiming for 50 pips because if we go to the this is the daily chart. If we go to this uh, zoomed out uh, daily chart, okay, we see that we have a previous high at uh, 147.50 right there. Okay, so I will place my final target uh, uh, barely a few pips, perhaps five pips below that level at uh, 147.45. Uh, okay. So, like I said, I'm, uh, I'm expecting about, uh, I'm aiming for about uh, 50 pips on, on this trade, okay? And, um, well, uh, I, I, I think I'll rather play it safe and exit here, okay, for, uh, for a fi uh, 50 pips of, uh, of profit, uh, rather than to risk a, a possible retrace of this previous high right there to the downside, okay? I don't want to risk that, I, I don't want to risk that, so I will exit at that level, okay? <coughs> Ah, excuse me. Um, that, well, that's about it, really. I will, I will, I will let you know how how this uh, trade uh, uh, turns out. Okay. All right. Bye bye. Hi guys. Um, just a quick update. Um, 21st of June 2007, uh, about noon in London. Um, 10 past noon actually. Um, just a quick update, like I say, to let you know that. Uh, Seems like we've we've gotten. Uh, let me zoom back into the uh, 15 minute chart for a clearer view. Uh, seems like we've gone through uh, retracement, okay, to retest the year uh, 27 uh, round number. If you remember, my entry is right here, okay. It came within within a couple of pips of my entry level, 
um, quite frankly, I was I was ready to close the trade. Uh, I, I one of my golden rules of of, tr of sensible trading is to never let uh, a winner turn uh, turn into a loser. This trade upon entry ran about uh, 35 pips uh, on in, pr in the profits. Okay, my my uh, my final target is at uh, 247.45. Uh, I'm aiming for uh, 40, uh, uh, 6 pips on this trade. Uh, you, you know, because uh, of the, uh, uh, if you guys remember, I showed you in the in the daily chart that we have a previous uh, uh, a previous swing uh, high right there. Okay, uh, so that's my final target. Uh, so, like I say, um, let's go back to the 15-minute chart. Uh, like I say, I was very ready to manually close the trades uh, at uh, at break even right there. Okay, I. I would hate to see uh, a trade, um, uh, what, it, what it's been, a profitable trade, turn into a loser, okay? Uh, that's, that, in my opinion, that's the most frustrating thing that, uh, that happens to a trader, okay? I'd rather, upon entry, uh, see price turning around and trigger my stop loss than seeing, uh, seeing my trade go, uh, um, go, I don't know, 20, 30 pips into profits and then uh, turn back down violently and, and, and kicking me out. Uh, it seems like, uh, well, it's, it's actually bouncing back to the upside uh, in momentum. I said, wow, look at that thing, man. Um, all right. <laughs> well, it seems like... Uh, Right, I might, I might uh, not need to uh, close my trade uh, uh, at all. But uh, anyway, that's not the point of this video. The point of this video was just, just to let you know that I, um, uh, it's about the uh, in-trade management, okay, guys? Uh, and like I say, that, uh, like I say, I, I was very ready to to close a trade uh, manually right here at, at break even, okay? Um, uh, yeah, you, you know, uh, it's uh, I. I, I got a little bit scared to be honest when I saw this retrace uh, all the way down here. I don't mind a little bit of retrace. I don't. I don't mind a little bit of meandering around or or, or very slow uh, uh, move to m to the upside. But uh, this was quite a sharp retrace. Okay, quite a sharp retrace. It happened over about uh, two hours. Okay, and it declined to over 40 pips in two hours. You know. You know. Um, not the kind of price action I like to see, but uh, well, it seems like the uh, 247 round number level has uh, has hold the uh, the uh, the bounce, all right. And uh, well, anyway, if if it does retrace again, once again, I, I'm 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 definitely uh, stepping out of this trade at this level, all right. Okay, guys, that was all. Bye bye. Hi guys, this sector again. Uh, 21st of June 2007, uh, 20 past 6 uh, p.m. Uh, London time. Um, <coughs> well, as you can see, uh, GBPCHF has been doing nothing but moving sideways, and uh, well, I just <laughs> I, I, I just can't waste my my time anymore in this trade. Um, um, stop is is moved to entry level. And uh, uh, and well, uh, target is still uh, up here at uh, 147.45, uh, and I'm I'm going out. Okay, I'm 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 leaving my my trading desk uh, for the day. This is uh, way too boring f to uh, to catch my attention on to or to even be worthy, uh, you know, to to stay uh, at the desk uh, anymore. Okay, all right, guys, that's all. Um, I'll, I'll 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 come back uh, tonight and uh, well I'll, I'll check uh, I'll check the trade and I'll I'll upload the uh, results on on the blog. All right, bye bye. Hi guys, and this sector. Um, one final update. I've just arrived home. Um, it's late in the night actually, and I've been um, my target seems to be hit uh, to have been hit four plus forty nine pips. Must have been right there. Okay, uh, my if you remember, my final target was uh, 247.45 uh, right there, and it was uh, it must have been touched uh, right there. Okay, so like I say, plus 49 pips uh, on this trade, very slow trade to all day long, moving sideways. Um, it was about to uh, to be touched uh, there, but then it retraced and meandered around for for many hours. But well, uh, if you remember, I I, I decided to. Just place my my exit limit orders and well, like I said, it's been touched uh, there for plus 49 pips. All right, guys, that's all. Bye bye.